If you get up early enough and get out on the prairie wetlands or grasslands on a foggy morning with heavy dew, you can sometimes witness one of nature's miracles of abundance. Millions of spiders and their webs full of captured prey, dew covered and glistening in the rising sun. Spiders often recycle their webs each day, taking them down and putting them up again at dusk, but when the dew is heavy they remain, and they're a buffet for the birds. Many have heard of giant bird-eating spiders like the Goliath spider of South America and other huge spiders that can trap tiny birds in their webs and eat them in the world's jungles. But the reality is birds regularly feast on spiders and the prey caught in their webs. An interesting practice called kleptoparasitism. Kleptoparasitism, parasitism by theft, is a form of feeding in which one animal takes prey or other food that was caught, collected, or otherwise prepared by another animal including stored food. But birds eating of spiders and stealing of prey from their webs is rarely observed. You ever wonder why birds love the prairie and the grasslands? Every night, night after night, ten millions of spiders spin a web in the grass. And on a nice foggy morning like this you can see them thousands upon thousands. And the birds will eat the spiders and also eat the insects that are caught in the spider's web. It's called kleptoparatism. Kleptoparatism. We've got videos of uh, warblers, you know, stealing the bugs right out of the spider webs. So this is an endless cycle that goes on night after night. And it just goes to show how much food there is out here for all the birds that live in the prairie. Here is several videos of warblers foraging on spider webs and eating spiders and the prey caught in the webs. Many species of birds regularly consume spiders as part of their diets. Insectivorous birds tend to consume spiders on more of a regular basis. These include wrens, sparrows, blackbirds, swallows, robins, tanagers, and bluebirds. Most birds that consume insects as part of their diet will also eat spiders, and just about any bird will eat spiders when the opportunity arises. Spiders contain relatively large amounts of taurine, which is an important nutrient for young birds as it impacts the memory and personality of the birds. Chicks that are fed more spiders when young are more likely to grow up to be bolder and are better learners. This might explain why birds are selective about what they feed their chicks, as at the early stages it can hugely affect the development of their offspring. Wrens in particular feed a lot of spiders to their chicks and are rather bold birds. Research has revealed that birds that feed spiders to their chicks like wrens do can positively impact both their learning and behavioral abilities. Birds will capture and consume both live and dead spiders but tend to prefer live ones. They're not too fussy and selective about which ones they eat but it's usually determined by what spider species are around in their habitat and are small enough to capture. Just about any spider is on the menu. It's a little harder for larger birds to pick off spiders from their webs that are out of reach of perches. Small warblers and sparrows can hover for brief periods to grab spiders and prey from their webs. 
Birds will catch spiders with their beak and can sometimes be seen bashing them against surfaces to kill them, although most of the time they just crush them in their beak. They also toss spiders in the air and attempt to either stun or kill it. When feeding their young, they will capture and kill a spider before flying back to the nest to feed the chicks. Birds tend to know which spiders to eat and sometimes eat venomous spiders, which aren't harmful to the birds. That's because the venom needs to be injected in the bloodstream to harm the bird, and eating it won't cause any harm. Providing the spider doesn't bite the birds on the way down, they'll not be harmed, as generally birds kill the spiders before eating them. This heavy-bodied female rose-breasted grosbeak really wants what's caught in this spider's web, and she's going to great lengths to get it. It's a little bit more of a challenge for a bigger bird to grab something out of a spider's web sometimes, but they'll eventually get it. The backyard screech owls love spiders, especially the bigger huntsmen and wolf spiders that crawl around the yard hunting after dark. Hummingbirds love their nectar, but much of their diet is insects and spiders, including baby spiders. Of course, all the spider web material is good for constructing nests, for binding the nest to a tree or a suitable surface to line the nest to ensure it stays together and strong.